I was uh, surprised that you weren't in the carriage. Skiving. So have you brought me some of your special? What is it today? Toad in the hole. Both vegetarian and carnivorous options. Green vegetables and gravy and... No, that's... Uh, that's not why I'm here. Uh, I said that before telling me what it is. Do you have time for any dinner? Is that on account of your distressing rendezvous? Me what? A heated discussion. Victoria Gardens earlier. You were involved in a heated exchange. I would go so far as to call it a distressed debate. The police are investigating the origins of the gun used in Natasha's murder. I want to know if the two things are connected. All right. <clears throat> OK, Poirot. It was me ex, Seb's dad. And, yeah, he was on about the gun. The police have figured out that he's used the gun before in a raid. So they suspect that it might have come to me, but don't worry, I'll deal with it. How? Well, I don't know. I'll talk nicely to him, pay him off, pop off one of his kneecaps, whatever it takes. Bribery, blackmail, threats of violence is a list of crimes. Not extensive enough. Have you got a better suggestion? I think perhaps the truth would be the least of all evils. No. The truth is consistent. Lying requires constant vigilance. Lies mutate, they change. I'm not sure that I have the mental capacity for yet another variant. Well, far be it from you to have to suffer a few sleepless nights just to keep me from prison. For, for something I, I, I wanted to do, but I didn't. Ah, oh, emotional blackmail to add to the list. All right, you said you wanted the truth. Well, here's the truth. I can't go back to prison. I, 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 I can't. No, not for Tezen. And not because of you. Please, Roy, please don't crack on me now. 